Fox, man. Out here hurting devil's feelings. <laughs> it's glorious to see. We are the ISGPK. Started out of 1 West, 130, uh, 145th Street, home of New York, under Commander Junior Hunter. Let's start off at Job 30 and 30. Black man, Hispanic man, and a Indian man. You understand? And yes, I said that. Black man, Hispanic man, and a Indian man, woman, and child. You are the true Jews of the Bible. Come look at this sign right here, and if you're on this sign, you are a true Jew. You understand? Not Jewish. Everybody watches the show called Blackish. Why do they call it Blackish? It's to be like. The ISH, the suffix ISH, means to be like. Kanye been running wild, been talking crazy. Ain't nobody said a damn thing to him. But the second that he said black people are the true Jews, boom, cancel. The second that Nick Cannon said it, boom, cancel. You understand? And my question is this. My question is this. Why come black people allowed to be Muslim? Why come they allowed to be any other religion, any other person on the face of this planet, but they can't be a Jew? You understand? Let me show you how messed up things is. You can switch your goddamn identity. A man can call himself a woman and the world has to respect it. A woman can call herself a man and the world has to respect it. But a black man can't say he's the real Jew? Right. Right. What kind of crap is that? So you trying to tell me that if I wanted to switch my gender, nobody would have a problem with it. But if I say that I am the Lord's chosen and that I am a Hebrew Israelite, that I am a Jew, all of a sudden there's a problem. Kanye got canceled because of that. Kanye could have said, call me Kanye and nobody would have said nothing. <laughs> nobody would have said a damn thing. Right. Nobody would have respect her. Right. Other than said, right. Kanye will switch his gender, respect that woman. Man, tell me one place you go on the face of this planet and you're not treated like a goddamn slave or a Negro. Right. You spread to the all four corners of the earth, and a nigga is a nigga, no matter where you at. Ask the black people over there in Ukraine when the war popped off. They was kicking them off of trains, kicking them off of planes to put white people first. And you think it's by design, you think it's by coincidence, it's by design, because your identity is the true Jews of the Bible, man. And you wanna know what color the Jews are? That's okay, that's what I'm here for. Let's, let's get that scripture, Job 30 and 30. Let's find out, let's see what Job 30 and 30 says. Job 30 and 30. Let's get it. You understand? Black man, Hispanic man, native Indian man. You are the true Jews of the Bible. Point blank period. No ends, ands, or buts about it. You understand? And the reason you don't know this is because you have been destroyed from the goddamn oppressor. Job 30 and 30. Let me know when you got it, mighty man. Look of Job 30 and 30, man. The oppressor is and always has been the goddamn devil the Bible speaks of. That's right. You to be some type of beast to tell, to tell people that they, a man can self-identify as a woman, a woman can self-identify as a man, but you can't claim to be the real Jews of the Bible. Right. What kind of animal are you, you goddamn oppressor? Look. Let's get it. Oh, God. Job, verse, Job, chapter 30, verse 30. Neither have I suffered by... I mean, uh, my mouth to say by wishing of. Is that in Job 30 and 30? Job 30 and 30. Maybe I got the wrong scripture right there. 30. Yeah. Neither have I suffered. Yeah, read that. That's 31. Yeah. 30. Right here. 30. Yep. Right there. there we go. Yeah, Job 30 and 30. Let's try this again. Let's take it from the top. Job, verse 30 and 30. My skin is. My skin, my skin is black upon me. Read that again. What did Job 30 and 30 say? My skin is black upon me. My skin is what? My skin is black upon me. Hey, listen, let me tell you something. The Jews are black. I bet you didn't know that, right? Right. right. Remember in the book of Revelations when it talks about the description of Christ? Guess what color he was? Black. If we know Christ, is a black man from the tribe of Judah. Why wouldn't these people be black? Right. Why come every nation on the face of this planet God looks like them, but you black man? You think it's a cool you think it just happened by accident? It's by design. Christ is a black man from the tribe of Judah. I dare somebody come try to prove me wrong. Nobody can debate the color of Christ. That's why when we say it, nobody has a goddamn thing to say. Because they know that that is the absolute truth. 
Let me get this seizure, boy. Let me show you something. This right here. This right here is your is racist right here. This right here, why ain't nobody boycotting this? Y'all wanna cancel every goddamn thing? Why ain't nobody cancel this? This is racist. Revelations don't say Christ is a white boy. Revelation describes Christ as black. Read that scripture one more time. My skin is black upon me. Your skin is what? My skin is black upon me. Most high Christ. Your skin is black upon me. Let me tell you something, black man, Hispanic man, native Indian man. You are the true Jew of the Bible, man. Yes, Let's get Psalms of right. one and five, real quick. Psalms of Solomon one and five. Songs of Solomon 1 and 5. Like Captain Kaposh brought out, we know the blasphemy and them that say they are Jews and are not. Right. We know you're a goddamn lie, Mr. White. Acts 13 and 1. You know what they call the priests, the prophets, and the teachers in the book of Acts? We got all these Christians out here to know the goddamn Bible. That's a serious question. What did they call the teachers and the priests, the prophets in the book of Acts? They called them Negroes, that's what they call them. They said these, these teachers are niggas, that's what they said. You got that scripture? So I wanted you to pull the book of Songs of Solomon. Songs of Solomon. Yeah, no swag. Let me tell you something. So, Solomon said this in the book of Songs of Solomon. He said, I am black, but comely. That's right. I am black, but beautiful. Right. Let me tell you something. Black is all through the Bible. Color is all through the Bible. I got a question. If color doesn't matter so much, Christians, why come any time black people say that they're the real Jews, they get canceled in white society when you're a part of white society? That's the difference between Kanye and I should be careful to command the junior honor. Let me tell you something. We've been saying the Jews are black since 1969. That's right. And nobody has done a goddamn thing about it because they can't. That's right. Because we're not in bed with the oppressor. We don't have business deals with the oppressor. We don't push the agenda and then turn around and push our own. We only push the most high agenda. Right. That's the agenda we push. We serve the most high. And the most high said, go out to these streets, cry out loud and spare not. So we don't give a damn about you goddamn devils. We don't give a damn about you goddamn individualites. We don't give a damn about none of that, man. We going to keep bringing out the truth of the Bible. We're going to keep teaching that blacks, Hispanics, and Native Indians are the true Jews of the Bible.